game on Sunday. Can you give us any early team news ahead of that? Um, I think we need to assess few players still, if, see if they can be involved. Uh, Sunday, um, and, and yes, and we we'll communicate tomorrow if we can recover some play from injury. Yes. Thiago Silva's in partial training. Has he got a chance to start? Yes, he has the, the chance. Uh, tomorrow we'll see if he's he's ready to be involved <coughs> on the on the game. Richard, what would it mean to you to maybe finally win a trophy in England? And does it play on your mind at all that? You still haven't managed to do that. Yeah, it's good that you say in England because you know <laughs> before when I was in Tottenham, I was away the first title like a, a coach. Um, I think uh, means a lot for for us like a coaching staff to to have the possibility to to arrive on the final and to and to challenge a team like Liverpool to win our first title here after 11 years when we arrived to in Southampton. And I think it's um yes, it's a it's a dream for us, like a coaching staff, and and of course we have the possibility. We are we have 90 minutes uh, to achieve that, and yes, we are going to fight. I think the team is ready. We are going to be very competitive, and it's, it's a, an amazing chance for us. You had that four-day spell around three or four weeks ago when you lost quite heavily to Liverpool. You lost at home to Wolves. Can you give us an insight on how low you were, how low the players were then, and what was said to prompt this turnaround in the past few days? Yes, it's true that it's different because never is the same. Uh, the approach when you play Premier League or when you play a final and, and then in the place like his neutral place like uh, Wembley. Of course, that is going to be different. Of course, you always like them uh, learn from the games that you play. I think too many things. Um, of course, that uh, we arrived on this game with different circumstances, and now uh, the, cir the circumstances change, and it's difficult to compare and to say that it's going to have and to uh, to have some influence the game that we play in the past. Uh, but of course, what uh, you learn is that Liverpool is a very competitive team, and they can play well, so well, very good, not so good, but they co they. They are going to be, or they always be competitive, and we need to match that, uh, that competitivity. We need to be competitive. We need to be uh, really to manage um, some moment during the games. Um, and I think in the last few weeks we were learning a lot. I think we step up from that, and and I think we arrive in a very good momentum. Uh, we arrive in a very good condition, and I think. After uh, Wolf competing against Aston Villa, Palace, and of course Manchester City, I think provide the team a little bit the confidence and the trust, um, and was like an, uh, the team start to be now, you know, awake of the competition. It's like uh, was a click to change in the way to compete that we were missing maybe in the first part of the competition in the, on the season. But uh, I need to, t to say that because too many circumstances, again, you know, the team that not provide us or don't to give the possibility to compete better. But I think it's too many things for sure. And, and of course, the circumstances are completely different from us and from them and see how they arrive and say how we arrive. But for sure, it's going to be Completely different because it's a final and it's, it's in Wembley. Jurgen Klopp was asked the question whether Liverpool were favourites for this game. He said definitely not. What do you think? Yeah, because uh, he's one of the best with Pep coaches on the world. And I, he's clever enough and he knows that when you arrive and you play a final, always circumstances can happen. Um, and of course, I think if they are not the favorite, we are not the favorite. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a final that <laughs> uh, you cannot say is a favorite. If he said that, for me, is Liverpool a favorite because after, uh, I think, eight years, you know, and in the last few years, they have the experience uh, to compete like a team and be involved in different uh, finals. And I think. For many, our player, 
is are uh, no only new in this competition in Premier League in the Carabao Cup. If not for uh, some of them, is maybe the first final. You know that is why make favorite them. Under my opinion, but he's clever enough to say okay, 50-50. In the Liverpool final, yeah, for sure, and he knows that it's like this. Uh, just a final one for me. Uh, you talked about 90 minutes on Sunday. It could go to extra time, of course. It could go to penalties, like the two finals in 2022. Have you been practicing penalties? Regular, always weeks. We always shoot penalties and train. Yes. And then it's completely different. Some coaches say you cannot replicate the same stress <clears throat> in training like it's after it's going to be in the competition. But of course, it's part of the also the the our idea is is to practice penalties. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you Donald. You're John, welcome. BBC. On this show. Hello. Uh, you said there was a kind of there's been a click, there's been a change since the Liverpool game and probably since the Wolves game as well. Is that a mentality thing? Is the mentality of the players changed? Nah, it's not fair to say only mentality. I think too many things change. Uh, I think always when it's the, with uh, all the young teams always need time uh, to be more mature and, and improve in different areas. But it's not only in our mentality. I think when you we talk about to play football or to compete, I think it's in the whole areas that you need to improve. And I think now the team is improving, and yes, maybe we have the chance, you know, to to be more consistent in the way that we compete. In the last three games, I think the team competed really, really well. Was the Liverpool game, and maybe more so the Wolves game, the catalyst when you and the players said, you know, something's got to change, it has to change? Was that was a real low point, wasn't it? I think for me, it's not about to change. Of course, the transformation of the team, and when we, you compete in a different way, is about. You know, to be more mature and to be, you know, this type of process, you need that this type of thing happen. And and to really, you know, uh, wake up about the situation. I don't know if you wake up or realize about that. Uh, when you experience some moment, you know, you, you have the possibility to, uh, to be different and to behave different. And the team always needs uh, to learn from the good and the not so good experience. And I think was in a moment that for us was positive. You know, after Liverpool, that was complete unfair, the result, because I think if you watch again the, the, the game, is a few penalties, that the penalty of after five minutes was given, I think maybe changed completely the, the game. Um, but maybe that was good for us to feel the pain, uh, negative situation again us, and to be you know stronger now and to and to find um, the way to compete better and to start to see that we need to live in a different way. The spirit of the the team, you can see, you can see that now the team. When it's on the on the pitch before they start the game, they are all together. Uh, they talk. The communication is much better. But always that need to be natural. When you build a team, always things that need to be natural. You cannot force to say, "Come on, you need to do this, to do that, to behave like this." Now you need to be nice with your teammate. Now you need to help your teammate. No, that, all this type of thing arrive in a natural way. If arrive in a natural way, I think they are so strong, but if you force, never, when the things are not natural, never work. And what will your emotions be, you know, just before you come down the tunnel at Wembley on Sunday and you've been brought here to win trophies and, you know, here's your, here's your chance? Yes, it's a chance there, and, and then for me, in Wembley, no Jesus is, is like home, because we, I think, yeah, we play a lot there with Tottenham, and I think is come back home, no, come back in uh, to your... Uh, no house, home, because I think after one year and a half competing there, I think we create a very good bond in between Wembley and and and, and the team and the, everyone there. Um, yes, for sure it's going to be special and special to play there and special in case to win. I think we are going to give our best to try to compete in our best and um, and be better than than Liverpool and deserve to to lift the trophy. 
Thank, Thank you. you. Simon Athletic. Hey, Richard, um, have you decided who's in goal? Yes, yes, yes. Have you told them? Yes, 99% of my team is in my head, of course. Have you, have you told the team already? Sorry? Have you told the players? No, not yet, not yet. Okay. Not yet because always, you know, connection, communication, you know, <coughs> always thing can happen and I prefer to tomorrow or maybe after tomorrow. No, because I say tomorrow you will start to find, you know, see, <laughs> see if you can some information to see. The final start and finish and that's it. And you store in the in the box, you know, because the final never a reference uh, that is going to translate to you know to this final when they happen. Of course, it's a it's a history, and of course, people pay attention. But us, when we prepare the the final, is not thinking in what happened one year ago, two year ago, three year ago. But of course. I respect, you know, yeah. your opinion and your question. Yes, tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me the question. Well, I was, was going to say, but can it actually be a good thing that a lot of your players don't have the baggage, the, the bad memories of, of losing? Them? Yes, I think it's possible, good things, so, and then uh, not to be affected for the past, and of course, um, in an, in another way, you know, they, they need experience, you know, to play a. Fa Play finals always is about to have the experience and the capacity to manage. I don't say the, 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 the game, but of course all the preparation and how you arrive. And the last one for me. There's been a lot of chat about the amount of injuries Liverpool have had recently. Do you have much sympathy given what you've experienced all season? Yes, I understand always, you know. I never you like to see uh, your opponent or, or teams that suffer, you know. Uh, Injured players, and, and of course, uh, we emphasize and we understand that because we were dealing from the beginning, and always is uh, is difficult. Uh, I understand. Uh, I think if I can say something that not to take in a bad way, I think always uh, in the middle when the the, the dynamic is positive. If you suffer some issue, always you can manage because the dynamic is positive and everything. Okay, you can, you know, uh, support and, and you can uh, find, you know, solution that can work easy. But when it's from the beginning, then you need to create an, a positive, you know, uh, <coughs> dynamic. If you are not capable to from the beginning that the thing work, always you are is <laughs> always is to try to change. To chasing, you know, uh, the rabbit, no, is in behind, in behind, in behind, in behind. Um, but I understand. I understand that the circumstances maybe are not easy today for the for the opponent. But competition is the competition. We cannot, you know, uh, complain. We cannot blame. Uh, you know, uh, we cannot find, you know, things um, that can affect it. You know, the players that are going to compete, and for sure. Liverpool is going to be Liverpool, and we need to go there thinking that we need to beat Liverpool. Thank you. Last question in the broadcast section, Rami. Um, Mauricio, you consistently said that this team is a young team and needs time. But some managers have said in the past that for finals, they are there to be won and not to be played. How crucial... I didn't say that we are going to go to play. I said final, you start and stop, and then you start. That is why. That is why final is, is not about to play finals. It's about to win the finals. Yes. Right. I, I just wanted to say that how crucial is this final to the project you are on now? Maybe you need another people here, you know, sitting in my in my place. For me I am focusing trying to win, but I, I cannot answer your question because it's not in my hand. Thank you. Cameras off, please, in the broadcast.